People have been using wood for different purposes since they learned how to, from making fire, building shelters, tools, even weapons, to arty works of marquetry. Let's take a look at the art of wood inlay in Iran. Persian handicraft is steeped in history and a big part of Persian tradition and culture that has always remained alongside its people even till this day. Persian handicraft has offered countless forms of eye-catching crafts that have left any visitor to this ancient land baffled and bedazzled. Now when you come to Tehran's handicraft hub you're met with amazing artwork and also handicraft work and you have so much to choose. There is one thing that really impressed me and it's this portrait. The interesting thing about this portrait is that everything here is made out of wood and I would really love to see how good at this and it will take a lot of time and a lot of effort to turn something like this into something special like this. I know that this is quite impressive and very amazing in every way but it's not just wood inlay that's amazing as well there's other kinds of inlay artwork there's also stone inlay and also metal inlay i've got something to show you <laughs> بورش میزنیم و با چسب به روی این اتصال برقرار میکنیم بعد اینو دوربری میکنیم وقتی که دوربری کردیم اینو میندازیم دور اون رنگیه رو جایگزین میکنیم However, these craftsmen have not restricted themselves to just using wood or just the technique of marketry itself. After all, it is a competitive market with customers always wanting high standards and unique works of art. Now, you see, the art of inlay isn't just about working with wood. You can also use different kinds of materials, and it really depends on the artist or the craftsman and what materials they want to use. They could use, well, different kinds of metals or even different kinds of stone, like a turquoise or, or maybe mosaic. It really depends on the artist and what kind of uh, result they want to produce with it. Nowadays, craftsmen include other materials, such as turquoise, and different techniques of inlay, such as intarsia, into their works. And sometimes, it is this combination and mixture of different elements that give it a one-of-a-kind finish. I'm 21 years old, I'm working on the same things that are available in the same things. I'm using a lot of fruit from the same things. We use them again. We use the same things that we use. We use the same things در میاریم یه قالب ام بی اف براش میگیریم این فیروزه ها داخل اون ریخته میشه با پلی استری که روی این فیروزه ها ریخته میشه این بسم الله فیکس میشه با فرز شروع میکنیم به فرم دادنش So you seen what these masters of marketry are capable of and it doesn't stop there talented artists of this caliber are seen in all areas of Persian handicraft and if you don't believe me then come and see for yourself Now this is something I wanted to show you. This is stone inlay. It's not complete yet, but when it is, you will see different veneers of wood added to this, making it truly amazing. Nowadays, craftsmen and artists, they use different kinds of techniques and different kinds of inlay to produce wonderful works of art that you see before you. I hope you enjoyed it, because I did. I'll see you next time. Reza Golzadeh for Iran.